the reading series at St. Charles Borromeo Church for our Lenten observance is the reading of the four signs of a dynamic Catholic. We often forget that a few people in the world have the greatest impact. It is told to us by the researchers of the four signs of a dynamic Catholic that approximately seven to eight percent of the people in the world really influence and use religion as a tremendous potential for growth and blessing within our society. Often we fail to realize that the impact of living for Christ and living with Christ can change the direction of the lives of so many, many people. But that message only gets out if we, the people of God, embrace the call to prayer, embrace the call to study, embrace the call to charity, and embrace the call to evangelization. Indeed, Jesus will be made known only if we embrace him and radiate his good example and his teachings in all that we do. The very objective of a Lenten reading program is to provide for us material, to give us facts and direction. For example, in regard to prayer, we need to set aside time every day for prayer. In prayer, Almighty God speaks to us, touches our hearts, helps us to know what to do. Study. There are so many things that we can learn about our faith. The Bible is replete with wonderful gems of knowledge. Yet, if we do not open the Bible, if we do not allow ourselves to answer and explore questions about our faith, we never really have an opportunity to learn and live more. Thirdly, Charity, works of charity. Jesus came in service of everyone. We continue the work of Jesus by our dedicated, humble service unto others. Giving of ourselves, giving our resources, giving of our prayer, our talents, our treasures, is the way in which the message of Jesus is cemented and grows. Lastly, evangelization. The call of the follower of Jesus is to be a bearer of Christ. And in doing that, we live our faith, we project our faith, we radiate our faith, and we speak of our faith. Maybe a little bit awkward at times, but it's the invitation and the call of the book called The Four Signs of a Dynamic Catholic. I do hope that you will take read, savor, and enjoy this magnificent book and allow it to be part of the Lenten journey that transforms you. Thank you so much. Please join with us in the four signs of a dynamic Catholic. Bless you and bless these 40 years.